The moment has arrived. It is time for the Elephant Bar Deadlift here in Columbus, Ohio at the 2020 Arnold Strongman Classic. Here is the event ins and outs. Three rounds to establish a one rep max deadlift. The heaviest lift wins and the top three will have the opportunity to participate in the Rogue Record Breakers portion of the competition. Looks like we are ready to go. Machas Belshak is going to be up first. 821 pounds will be his initial attempt. You can see that right hip is really a and he's been having hip issues throughout the competition, so he is not going to give it a go here. See Arnold right in front of Mateusz Kieliszkowski. Let's see if the governor has any words of encouragement. 821 pounds. Very impressive. Great lift. Very smooth. Seems there is plenty of meat left on that bone as well for him. Yes, there is. Alexei Novikov is next. He'll attempt 821 pounds. We'll talk a little bit about contrasting styles. Notice how he's got his hands more closely together, his feet a little more closely together. Watch this bar flex when the big man makes a move. <laughs> Let him hear Yes! H21. Alexei Novikov successful on his first lift. Very good lift. He also wants to keep this going and finish the competition strong. So just like Haftor, he's he's measuring up the competition. Really good from the Carone starting the day in fifth place. He is, even with his best performance and Kieliszkowski's worst performance, could not catch him in this individual event, but he could certainly make up a lot of the distance. First attempt, 891 pounds. Making it look easy. Wow. Oh, he made that look easy. I don't think I could lift, lift a broomstick that quickly. <laughs> that was quite a lift. He's a professional. This is the highlight of his year. He's going to do what has to happen to stay in this competition. Special forces in the Russian military. He's going to feel this in his ankle. An injured ankle. Nine hundred one pounds. Very routine lift. Pritchett, the deadlift feels like home for this big man. Nine hundred and six pounds. Nine hundred six pounds on the bar. Very wide hand placement, foot placement. Really gets his hips down. Has it, has it fairly easily. It does. Looks like he's a little ginger when he stood up there. So I don't know if there's the second day of competition or if there's something that we haven't understood about how he feels today. Martins Leachy still has to go at 9.06. 906 pounds for Leases. First attempt, 906 pounds, controlling the bar very nicely. Good lift. Very methodical. He had to put a extra gear to get that weight off the off the ground. Nine hundred and eleven pounds getting strapped in. The uh, figure eight straps are not allowed, so the athletes can use straps that they have to manually put on the bar. It's a safety issue. about that Bobby very Thompson. Smooth. very nice he looks stronger than than a number of the other athletes I'll say that Rob Kearney amongst everyone else has the heaviest starting weight Rob Kearney 28 years old from Massachusetts Rob Kearney, here we go. 921 on the bar Great second effort. 
He got it. Had that second effort halfway, but he's able to get it up. Hathor's had fantastic training. I really expect this to be very, very routine for him. Six feet nine inches tall, 440 pounds. Hathor Bjornsson. Talk of going for 500 kilos, but it starts right here. 961 First lift, 961 pounds. He's going to roll the bar Come back. On. That's that's his technique. Oh, wow. <laughs> <There's plenty laughs> that was that was great. <laughs> right. We see Nova Kov from Kiev, Ukraine. Second attempt. He's already been successful at 821. Get it to your knees. Oh, got it right there. He did control that flex pretty well off the ground. And if he could just have gotten it to his knees, he could have pulled back and I think finished that lift. So he needs to he needs to really make sure that he starts that bar and builds up that momentum in his body, takes that flex out of the bar, and he just needs to get it to his knees and fight that bar. That's that's going to be the key for him really is to just do the things we're talking about and get it to his knees and give himself a chance to complete the lift. All right, he needs your help now. This will Come give on. him a couple more placements. Every point counts. Got two event wins already under his belt. And he lifted 886. There you go. Got it to his knees. He can finish it. That bar is flexing, but he's controlling it. Oh. The strap broke. Oh, my goodness. Wow. That is frustrating. That is frustrating. Great lift. It looked like he was going to complete it. Oh. It's being called a missed lift with an equipment failure. So it counts as a missed lift. Okay. So next up is going to be Bobby Thompson, and he will be going at 926 pounds. This will put him in second overall in this event. Of course, a lot of lifting left to go. Bobby Thompson. Wow. That's a great lift. That's really strong. He's looking around. He's just soaking that up. First time here. He's loving this. He feels like also he's validating himself a little bit. He's had a tough time, as you said, and comes out and smokes a huge lift. This athlete has a lot of pride. Finished third back in 2018. He'll be attempting 941 pounds. He's going to give everything he's got. I know it. He's, I, I expect him to complete this lift. down good start he's got it to his knees keep coming yeah great lift very strong Mikhail Shivliakov let's see what we can produce here come on, come on. Rowan ready to attempt 956 pounds oh, wow. very smooth very nice Canadian strong wow He's got a thousand pounds in him, I'm certain. Rob Kearney. Okay, looks like he's setting the straps up maybe a little bit wider than he did the first time, or but the fairly narrow stance. First one, first one was a little bit tough for him, but he's Come on. Come on. setting his hips, getting the flex out of the bar. Just get it to your knees. Get it to your knees. Whoa. Great effort, Great effort, though. But again, if you can get it to your knees, you have a chance. Right. Come on, he, he really needs this. Nine this is a very pivotal lift, obviously. He, obviously, he all, a lot out. of the lifts are pivotal, but this is really a pivotal lift for the entire He's competition. Hips down, gets the ball. Oh, just wow. not there. Just. Martins, that was successful at 961. Wow, that was surprising actually. 
981 pounds would be our new best lift of the day. Jerry started weight training when he was 15 years old, deadlifted 460 in his first meet. More than double that being attempted here in the 2020 Jerry. Arnold Strongman Classic. Come on, Jerry. Got it to his knees, pull back, pull back, finish. That is actually shocking. Wow. That's shocking. And you can wow. Huge He's asking for his family and friends to get there behind him here. 1,026, a huge statement. Come on, Hapthor, let's see this. That's well within striking distance for a big third attempt. Let's see how well this goes for him. No shoes, he's just coming out and going at it. Come on, Hapdor. Takes the flex out of the bar, gets to his knees. Wow, routine. That is unbelievable. 1,026 wow. pounds. Hapdor Bjornsson. <laughs> this is his to lose. It's so hard to come back. I see a 24 year old who holds a master's degree in international economics. He's making a business decision here with his weight choice at 851. Yes. Unsuccessful in his first attempt. Can he do it here? No. Just couldn't get the flex out of the bar. 886 pounds. It was a, an equipment failure. He thinks that he can go up a little bit, and he did. This would be a terrific personal best for him on this bar at this competition. Also, mentally, he wants to make sure that everybody knows that He's continuing to improve on the deadlift, and he'll be coming with it. One trial by Stone. One wheel of pain. Looking for a personal best here on the elephant bar deadlift. 886. Paul, Paul, get it to his knees. Come on. Okay. Keep fighting it. Control it. Control it. Can he do it? That bar is moving. Fighting away. Yeah. Yes. Wow. See, that is exactly what he was trying to do. He did complete the lift, and you see how much that meant to him after the lift. And that means that he's making improvement on the deadlift. I really expect him to give us a show on this lift. Come on, Misha. Special Forces Black Beret. Order the Zhukov Medal for Valor in his military career. He's been quite the performer. Can he live? 956. Oh. What a great effort, though. Salute this man. I think his ankle talked to him on that lift. Next up is going to be Jerry Pritchett, who is going to attempt again at 981. He's going to fight that bar to get the flex out. Get it to his knees. Come on, Jerry. Finish it. Got it to his knees. Oh. He needed another inch, literally another inch, and he would have passed his knees and stood up with it. And so it's going to be Bobby Thompson next, and he is going to try and join the 1,000-pound club going at 1,001. Get his, getting his strap set, checking the flex on the bar. The crowd's behind him. Hips down. Let's go, Bobby. Oh, okay. <laughs> Not meant to be. Not so today. Only one thousand pound lift here at the 2020 Arnold Strongman Classic. A winner with a lift of 1,026 pounds. Making a routine, takes the flex out of the bar, doesn't even double clutch at the knees. Over a thousand lift. pounds. So Half Thor standing by with Kiki Dixon. Half Thor, you just lifted an incredible amount of weight. How on earth does that feel? Feels great. You know, I'm super pleased, super happy. I was able to um, perform super well, only do two lifts, save a little bit of energy, so I'm, you know, beyond happy.